The uh, Helix Code Zero that we made for Main Street is a 75% girth spinnaker. The Helix is just our latest version of the Code Zero. Code Zeros have changed a lot over the years. We designed and built a Doyle Stratus uh, cableless Code Zero for this boat. Uh, so there's no physical uh, luff cable. Um, as most people would think about when it comes to code zeros. So that greatly reduces all of the, the loads on the luff of the sail. Uh, the sails are built for a specific wind condition. Uh, the fact that they can furl is just an advancement in the technology of the gear that is available for boats now. And uh, Steve Orlebeck within Harkin actually came up with a pretty good idea of combine the reflex technology that you guys have done with the reflex furler into the cable of sail. We started with a clean sheet and tried to think of the simplest answer to that problem and it, as it turns out it's just a, a simple tack plate that gets webbed onto the tack of the sail and the head swivel just has a radius bail on it and you just the sail maker sews the head swivel to the head of the sail. The lower drive units in the reflex are several races of Torlon ball bearings. The bearings in the upper swivel are creased steel needle roller bearings, and the reason we did that was to keep the head swivels really small and compact. And the result is the, the shortest combination of hardware it maximizes the sail luff, and everything is very light as well. Now the one thing that's nice about that is you can actually, it, it goes a bit further to maximize your total luff length. The luff of the sail projects forward, so instead of a straight luff sail, it actually has a little bit of a positive luff curve. We were using the sail towards the top of its range, and it furled cleanly and easily. It was very little effort in getting the sail to furl. The reflex was originally designed to work with a torsion cable to furl downwind spinnakers. From the sails like the A2s and A3s with the torsion cable, We've got a really good solution, and now we can also handle these cableless zeros.